guys, this is Eric. So we are out in Jackson, Mississippi. We are at their law enforcement training academy. Uh, to my left, we have the uh, FBI shooting range over there. So we did a little bit of work over there. So now we over here on the other side of the FBI shooting range. So what we're gonna be doing today, um, I do have a gun that I want to shoot um, and an optic that I want to show you guys. Um, this optic is pretty cool. Um, it is a tad bit big, but it's an awesome sight. I've never seen a sight that I can run on a handgun that I can actually run with my MBG. So this is awesome. It's got saddings on it. You can dial it down to use it with your night vision goggles or whatever, um, which is spectacular. So it's a aim point or more to go on top of your your handgun so it's, it's sweet I love it I love it uh, but we're gonna be doing it just a couple of drills um, not a whole lot it's hot out here in Mississippi Sun is like straight up there um, I don't see a cloud <laughs> in the air right now but um, so we're not gonna stay out here a, a long time shooting but I did want to just show the gun and here just in a few but we're gonna be doing some shooting first and then I'll show you the gun so I'm gonna just run a course and then we just go for now. Without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and get into the shooting. Uh, we're gonna start here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna shoot. Well, you'll see what I'm gonna do. I'm not even gonna explain it. So we're just gonna get into shooting. Let me put my ears on and then we're gonna get started. Brighten this up a little bit. All right, so shooting a red dot, it takes sometimes it may like an RMR may take a little bit of time to. This is my first time shooting with this optic, so having to find that optic on it. Um, again, I, I don't run a lot of optics on my handgun, so we're gonna move back. We're gonna do the same thing we just did here, back there. It's just something that I like to practice: standing, down on side, back inside shooting you never know what kind of situation you're going to be in or what life's going to throw at you so you want to be prepared so we're going to move back but this right here should be should be i think the 15 yard line so we're going to do the same thing So I was at 25. I like that. Wait an eye.
it is hot this is a huge range out here so we're gonna be out here all day doing some stuff i just wanted to throw a little training thing in there for you guys to think about doing you know you go to the range if the range allow you to do it get out here in the range and shoot practice these certain things you never know what life's going to throw at you you may hit the ground while running okay and if you hit the ground while running and you have to engage your target you want to be able to engage your target whether it's from your back from your side left side or right side or standing okay the only thing i didn't incorporate in here was the kneeling uh kneeling is give me uh kneeling is just like standing basically but i think you have a little bit more stability when you're kneeling actually than you do have actual standing so um like I said, this is a huge range, as you can see, back all the way over here, um, it's huge. This range right here has a total of 97 lanes. 97 lanes, guys, 97 lanes, that's a lot. That's a lot of lanes. And uh, back in front of me, back over the hill there, is the FBI's uh, range, uh, their qualification range over there, so it's very nice, we shot on there too. Uh, very nice range. Um, it's beautiful. It's just absolutely beautiful out here. And uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you take something from the video. Um, if you take something from the video, at least take that. You never know what life's going to throw at you, whether you're on the ground, standing up, just be ready for whatever. If you miss in a certain spot, I suggest that you stay in that spot until you get it right. And if you get it right one time, do it a couple more times to make sure you get it right in that spot. Then you can get up and move again. Okay, so did it, miss view, go back, run it, run it until you get it perfect, run it until you get it perfect. Now, after you get it perfect, run it five more times, okay? And I know a lot of people say, well, ammo, ammo, ammo. Yes, ammo is expensive, ammo is hard to get, but which is more important, you know, being out here practicing for a situation that may save your life or may save your loved one's life. To me, it's important to get out here, no matter the cost of the ammo, and practice just in case I have to save someone's life, including mine or my family's life or anybody around me's life. So, guys, I greatly appreciate you watching. If you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button. For all those who have subscribed, I greatly appreciate it. And as always, stay safe, be safe, and do what? Watch your six, guys.